What's up guys, today I'm going to be teaching you how to do a edit in Sony Vegas Pro 11. So you want to, gonna first you're going to want to open Sony Vegas. Alright, and then once that's opened, you're going to want to open your trick shot or whatever you're going to edit. For, for me, I'm going to do a trick shot on Monroe for 2. So then I'll just go to libraries, documents. And then I'm going to want to open the trick shot. So it'll be this one. Alright, so here's the trick shot. And then I'm going to open the the audio I want to put over it. So I'll open Skrillex Roughneck, because that has a good bass drop in it. So you're going to want to open that. And then you're going to want to find the bass drop in the in the song. And then as soon as the bass drop happens, hit S on the keyboard for split. So once it drops, bass drop. Are you ready for the lost bass? 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 All right, so there's the bass drop. So you want to cut, click, right click on the left stuff, and cut that out. And then you're gonna want to click on this and pull this down. So it goes down twice. And then, alright. And then you're going to go back up to your trick shot. And then you're going to want to hit the up arrow to make it go to the right. Alright. Find the trick shot. So, for me, I just go back to frames and look for the muzzle flash where it's shot. So it would be... Keep going back... For me, it'd be 193 or 192. I'll pick 192 because it's closer to when the shot happens. Alright, and then you're going to want to hit M to make a marker. Alright, go back to your music video. And wherever you... Where the fuck is it? Alright, pull this over. Alright, hit down on the arrow to make it come back. And then you're going to want to put the beginning of this onto the marker so it, it, it clicks into place. And then you're going to want to make it come up to this and pull it to the left. So it'll it'll the audio will start and then as soon as the bass drop happens it shoots. And then you're going to want to do that and just pull this back. Don't do that yet. Are you ready for the lost bass? And then once it shoots, the bass drop. Alright, so then you're going to come to the end of the trick shot and hit M for a marker there and then pull this so it goes there. So the video doesn't keep going on with the video, with the audio, no video. So then hit down, up on the, ar the up arrow so that happens and then you're going to want to hit mute on the music video on the music videos video hit that mute button right there and then you're gonna go to the game volume and either turn it down or unless you want it louder or mute it I'm gonna mute it because I think it just sounds better with the bass drop and not the gun sounds alright so now on to the real editing what you wanna do is find the frame your thing is I already put a marker there so I'll just click on the marker to bring me right to the frame of the trick shot and then I'm going to want to hit S for split. Alright, let me just go back to the marker split. Alright, don't you don't want to click up here because that will split everything. So just click on it here and then hit S. Alright, so once it's split, on the left over here, if you see this, it will say event FX. That's for before the trick shot. So if you want it to be like the screen will be tilted... And then when you shoot, it'll go normal. You just want to put it however you want it, maybe upside down, whatever. And then you're just going to want to, you could zoom it in, zoom it out. Um, you could also do this. That's the same thing. All right. And then you're going to want to sit save. Save is right here. All right. So then when it's like, it's tilted. And then when you shoot, boom, normal. And, um, the next thing, if you want to make it, like, this is, I'm just, this is how I like to edit. I like to make it black and white and tilted. 
black and white and tilted before. And then once you shoot, it gets like, it looks more like HD. And then over here on the right is the event effects after. So you're going to want to click right, not right click. You just want to click that. And you could put in anything here you want. I like the screen to jitter, so I'm going to go to film effects, Sony film effects. Hit OK. And then grain, you can see on the right is like that stuff. Like right over here, it's that stuff. So I'm not going to put too much of that in. Just a little bit. Tint, I'm going to keep that all the way down. I don't know why, I just don't like it. And then you're going to want to hit jitter. Enable particles off. And then amount, 32 I'm going to go because it doesn't jitter that much. And if it says that, like when you try to save it, then just make your own name here and save everything to that I wrote cool because uh, I guess it's pretty cool and then just save that alright green okay so I'll save so when I come to here kind of jitters but you can't really tell because the screen sideways anyway but so if you want to trick shot on, you just hit this button right here, plug in chain, and then add anything you want. If you want event FX before the video, before the trick shot, you can just click event FX here, hit add, you can add anything you want. Um, if you want the, it to fade away, like here, you click, if you want it to fade in the beginning, you click like this. Like that, so when you watch it, see how it faded in right there in the beginning. I don't like fade in, I like fade out, so I'm gonna take that off. And you come all the way over the right, top right, and then you're gonna wanna click it left until wherever you want it to fade from. So it'll say 408, that's 408 seconds from the end. So then I'll click here and I'll see it. I like that, I just want to fade a little more, so I'm going to pull it left a little more. Alright. Well, if you guys have any questions about any other editing... Oh, another thing, actually, before I end this video. If you want to... If you want more editing ideas, just search on YouTube for editing packs. I don't really know how to do an editing pack, of course. But, um, if you want editing packs, just download any of them and put them to your desktop or somewhere you, you will be able to find it go to open and then I, mine's on my desktop so I'll just click desktop and this one's jcraft editing pack is youtuber jcraft and then I'll double click that that and then there will be all these different things and then that's all the different um added addings I could put on jcraft color correction which makes it look more HD gun sound cinematics Optical flares, overlays, all that stuff. Yeah. And then you just choose whatever you want. See cinematics, I'll double click. COD4 model for two, model for two. And there'll be all these different things you get add to the video. So then the next thing, the next video, I'll be teaching you guys the best um the best rendering settings. So be sure to check that out if you want your videos to look good HD. Um thank you for watching and stay frosty.